my name's Maddie. Um, this is my first video, so there probably will be a lot of mistakes. <laughs> but I just wanted to inform you and show you uh, a packing video of how I pack for my three kids when we're out and about. So, yeah, let's get right into it. So this is the Jujube for Hello Kitty. And if nobody knows what Jujube is, do your research. <laughs> I'm in love with Jujube right now. Uh, but yes, this is the Jujube um, Out to Sea, Be Right Back. And it's a backpack uh, diaper bag. So I like this one a lot. So we'll get right into it and show you how I pack it for a day out with my three kids. So in this pocket right here, um, it has a snap, and this has a cute little Hello Kitty thing. I never take it out because I just I like the kitty on there, so I'm not taking it out. But you can put a picture of your kid if you want, um, or of your family, or just whatever your preference is. But I just like the kitty on there. So really, in this pocket, I put my phone in because it my phone is a uh, a Galaxy Note five. I have not changed it. <laughs> since I've got it but yeah I put it in there with my cover and it fits great and also I have my box charger just a short one right now I usually have a longer uh, cord but right now I have my short one with me because I can't find my long one and here it has another pocket and in this pocket they call it the mommy pocket and it's really for all your mommy needs of what would be easier for you to be organized and not have it clashing with what's organized for your kids or other things that you already have packed. So in here I have a key fob that has my keys attached to it and I just like this because in case I every time I'm out and about uh, sometimes I always leave my bag open halfway and just because I mean I have I have toddlers and I have a baby so I mean you just never know when sometimes I I get distracted and it's open halfway and if this thing ever falls or tumbles I know my keys are going to be safe because it's on that key fob. So I really like that feature. And on here in this mesh pocket right here I have a small set piece in the Jujube uh, print uh, out to sea. And in here uh, I have a coin purse inside my set piece. That has just my cash and change and I usually take this with me if I'm just gonna go for a quick errand to the store and I don't want to take the whole diaper bag with me and just have that whole hassle of trying to get the kids out and then having to take the bag and if I just have this with me it's really really easy for me to just um, go out um, what I will explain to you is it does have the D rings here in which I usually have a little strap with me like I said so if I just want to take a quick a trip to the store and not take the big bag I can just pull it with me and I can have it on my wrist or have a longer one and have it on my shoulder so it's really easy for me to access so yeah I really like that and then in this side this is mainly people use it for their sunglasses which right now it's not really that sunny um here in Texas where well where I'm at uh, it's been cold, so <laughs> it's not really bright for me to wear sunglasses or anything, but yeah. So in this pocket, I really have, uh, stuff for my daughter. Um, it's really hair essentials for me and my daughter, because our hair is just curly and crazy, and it's just good to have. So yeah, that's what I have in there. And then... If you can see down here, there's more space, which I love. And it has another mesh pocket, which is pretty big. You can put anything you want in there. But me, I put in my Be Rich um, wallet. And I really love this wallet. It's um, it's a Tokidoki print of the... I think it's the Donatella Sweet Shop, if I'm not mistaken. Or it could be the Toki Pops. I think this is what this is. And I really love it. It's big. It carries everything uh, that I have, which I have a whole bunch of cards. So much. 
just because I have my insurance cards, important papers, cards, um, rewards cards, all that stuff. So yeah, I'm a big card holder. So that's the mommy pocket. And uh, we'll go into, I'm going to show you this uh, fob in a minute, but I really want to get into this. So this is a tech pocket up here. And really what the tech pocket's for is for your technology. <laughs> Hence the tech. So this could be for your phone or maybe even, I really think it's just for your phone. I don't think you could fit a mini tablet in there. You might be able to, but I think it might be a little too small. But it does go about to my wrist down there. So you could fit maybe an iPhone 6 Plus if, if that's what y'all have, if that's the biggest phone you have. And all I really carry on it, I don't like to carry my phone in there, is uh, a medicine bag, a medicine kit, really. Um, I just like to have it just because since our seasons here are a little wonky or crazy, uh, we just like to have medicine on us because our kids get sick quick, quickly. So, yeah. Um, so, I, yeah, I'm going to skip this right now and show you the sides. So, on the sides... We have these uh, bottle holders or cup holders, however you want to use it. And it really does go all the way down to my wrist. Or a little bit more because I have a small wrist. But, I mean, yeah. So this, and I'm pretty sure you can fit a good size cup in there. I haven't really tried this out to tell you for sure. But I can already tell if you know what those fun teener size are, uh, that would fit in there. Um, let me see. Oh, yeah. Okay, so I do have a fun teener here. So this is a fun teener. I love these. It's good whenever you want it hot or cold. And uh, let me see if I can get this in there. So it does fit. Um, it's just a little work to get it in and out because of that elastic that it has. But it does fit in there. And the other side also has one. So you have two. One on each side. And I got this one. I think this is our Kylo Ren. Yes, this is our Star Wars uh, cup water bottle that my sister-in-law actually got for Oscar so I'm pretty sure I'm gonna pause the video real quick so I can get it in there I'm using my phone right now um, I usually use my camera for recording but it's charging right now so give me one second all right so yeah that fits in there nicely as well and it doesn't really mess with anything or it's just there on the sides and it doesn't really look that bad either having it that way so it has it fits this size water bottle as well so I'm pretty sure it would probably fit a swell a uh, water bottle which are those uh, iron containers that are like weird shaped <laughs> I can't even explain it right now but yeah I'm pretty sure that would fit in there as well so it's really good and now I will show you this side because this side has a pocket on this side right here. And the one cool thing about Jujubee's diaper bags, and I'm pretty sure all diaper bags have it, but this diaper bag, well, no, not really. Not all diaper bags, but most of the diaper bags that I have got from Jujubee, they all come with a changing pad. And this changing pad is so cute. I mean, look at this. It is so cute, guys. I love it. The back is all red, which is pretty cool. I mean, I don't think you can really see. Yeah, I don't think my camera's going to be able to show you. Oh, maybe you can see a little bit, but it has Hello Kitties on there. It says Hello Kitty on that glossy uh, side of the changing pad. So it's really, really pretty. And yeah, and I also like to put uh, my planner in here. I just started getting into plan, plan planner planning. Ugh. 
and uh, it's really fun. It's really soothing. <laughs> so that's my new hobby besides this. And I really put, I put that in there as well. And if you look at the back, um, it's so, so comfortable. It has that memory foam and I love it. It's not, it does not hurt my back. It's really giving me a lot of support. So I really love it. And I don't know if you could see this. But it has stars and a bow from the Hello Kitty, so I love that. And the straps are the same. They're both memory foam, so it's very comfortable on your shoulders. And it's also adjustable, so this is really great. Um, over here on the top is another pocket, which I love. And this pocket I really use, you can use for easy access. Stuff like, well, for me personally, since I have my three kids, I have wipes with me all the time, and it, they're just a godsend. Seriously, uh, if I'm out and about, and uh, I usually have my boogie wipes in there as well, and they're so messy. <laughs> kids are so messy, so it's just great to have that closure and comfort that you know what I'm gonna be able to get wipes right away and clean them off before they get super dirty. Or super messy so that's what I have in that pocket and now I think on um, also here we have a good strap handle so if you're those people that I personally don't like to have my bag on the floor but when I have to like there's no way I can have it on top of something or in a chair or anything I have to have it near me um, it has a really good grip so if you need to pull it and take it it's there perfect support and now we'll go to the front. These are also the D-rings. And these are really for uh, stroller straps. So you want to take it with you and have it on the stroller. Uh, you just get some straps uh, for it. It doesn't come with straps. That's the only thing. But you can just get any sort of straps that work for you. And it will be used uh, on your stroller and just hang on there. So yeah. Now I'm going to open the bag, but before I do, I wanted to show you uh, this really cute fob. And uh, this fob is by Andrea, and she's on Facebook. Um, Fobs by Andrea is her page, and uh, this is just really cute, guys. Uh, I mean, look at this cute little heart ring here. It is so adorable, and these little roses all these colors they're so pretty and I love Lilo and Stitch <laughs> and I love Tsum Tsum so I asked her if she could find me something that was Tsum Tsum, Lilo and Stitch and she found these for me and showed me a really cool idea and I loved it and she's so understanding she listens to your ideas she works with you and she's just great so this is another one of my <laughs> uh, obsessions, I guess. But I've only got two. So I have this one mm -hmm. and my Winnie the Pooh. So this is really, really great. And so yeah, that's that. And now I am going to open the inside of the bag so you can see what it looks like on the inside. And it does open from both sides. And before I even do that, you can open it all the way down on both sides. So I think I will do that, but I think some of my stuff might fall down. Uh, no, it's okay. <laughs> Everything's okay. So this is how it looks on the inside. I'm kind of going to just take this out though so you can kind of see it better. So I'm not packing a lot today. That's why it looks the way it looks right now. But this is how it looks on the inside. And without all this stuff here, and I will show you, um, it actually is really spacious. So I will go up here and start from the top. And here at the top, it has two straps here. And what I really use these for is I usually put my wipes in there, an extra set of wipes if I need to. And right now I have a set of clothes because I'm just taking my son to the dentist tomorrow. So that's why I have just that one set. And I have his uh, cup in here. And I could put it inside the 
the cup holders we have on the side but I really don't want to because since it has handles it's really bulky and I just don't want to struggle to push it in there and take it out so I have it here which I think it looks okay and then here the set of clothes like I said I just have this here um, I just want to have one pair I usually put two pairs but just one pair will be good for right now and the thing I took out right now is my uh, nursing cover and I love this nursing cover I'm not for sure on the print or the style um, I would have to look that up but I love it because you can hang it and I usually and I had it on the outside of my diaper bag but I didn't really like the way it was hanging and I kind of need another fob to have it on there so maybe I would do that but I just want to show you this it's so cool um, I got this whenever I was gonna have my last my third son sorry my third child my third son I have only two and um, so yeah I just opened it right now and this is really how it looks it's a big nursing cover super thin so it's good for summertime and here's the handle it's for you and what I love about this side is you can slide this ring so if your feet already fed on this side you can just slide it over here to this side so you know where to start to eat so I really like that it keeps track of of what side I gave them first so I'm not engorged throughout the day but yeah so that's my nursing cover here in the back you see all this extra space here this is really what I wanted to show you so even here the way that this is here you can still add a ton more stuff if you want it to um, I really am a heavy packer but today I'm trying to keep it light so that's how my bag looks right now so in this pocket here I really should say pocket I should say in this bag this is a large set piece and it matches my uh, diaper bag and this is the GGB for Hello Kitty the out to sea uh, print and really all I have in this is uh, my diapering needs so I have about one two three four diapers and my diaper cream this is homemade diaper cream yeah it looks kind of gross right now <laughs> but uh, I usually have it in another container not this one but I seriously don't know what's wrong with me today like I cannot find anything so I kind of just put it in one of those uh, bowls with the lids but this homemade uh, diaper cream is a godsend. I mean, seriously, it is so great. And uh, maybe I'll do a video on how to make it. But I love it so much. I just, I was just Pinterest, Pinteresting on Pinterest and looking up things and for diaper rashes because a lot of stuff that we would buy would not work. We would get the Dr. Smiths. Uh, we get the desitins and I mean they would work for a bit but then it just seemed like to get worse so I just went on Pinterest was looking up more ideas and see if they had some kind of remedies or whatever and I found this really cool remedy and I kind of made it my own and I use this every time they get a diaper rash and it works great so yeah and in this bag here this is my other Tokidoki I love this print this is space place and uh, there's Donatini right here, this little puppy. <laughs> Love him. And Donatella. And uh, yeah, so in this uh, set piece here, this large set piece, let's see if I can open it. And this just has my kids' toys. Um, so yeah, these are just toys some cars, some stuff for the baby. And my daughter some toys for her so that's what's in here for them and then in this back part it has a big mesh pocket so you can add more stuff if you would like to all I have in this one is a medium set piece in my GGB uh, Hello Kitty and this is also the out to sea um, print and this is actually a set, so that coin purse I showed you earlier and that diaper one I showed you, they're all together. And so this one is my uh, feeding 
needs for my children. Uh, some snacks. We got some um, rice rusks. And these are good for babies that are teething or just learning how to chew on stuff. It easily dissolves in their mouths. It's kind of like the cereal puffs, but they're just little biscuit sticks. So they're really, really good for the babies. Um, I have some fruit snacks. I have a bib for my younger one. He loves Mickey right now. So we found these at Walmart and they were on sale. They were $3 for two in a pack. So that was really good. And then I have their uh, toothpaste, tooth and gum cleanser, um, just to brush their teeth right after they eat. And I got some utensils for all three of my kids because uh, I don't really like to use the ones at the restaurants because they're pretty big and they're still learning how to eat properly, especially my son, my older son. So. Uh, I'd rather just use the ones we have at the house. And this is some teething gel. My youngest is teething right now. And I have these teething tablets. Uh, I don't really use the teething tablets anymore because it doesn't really do much in my opinion. But I still have them there just in case uh, I don't have teething gel. It's just a good um, substitute in case it's not there for me or if I forget it, so I have that. So yeah, that's that's all that's in this side of the bag. And I'm gonna turn it over so you can see the other side. And what's really cool about this bag as well is it's kind of like a luggage, um, like a suitcase rather. And I really like it because it's so spacious and you can use this for different things. I'm just showing you how I pack it, but there's so many ways you can use this. I mean, you can probably put the clothes in here if you wanted to. Um, that's usually what I do. I usually put um, my kids' uh, extra clothes. I always have like a t-shirt or sometimes I'll have like a sweatshirt just because of the weather changing and some socks or, you know, just, just however you want to use it. But this time in particular, I have this for days of... Uh, just I have it for things that I would pack but not use daily. So, um, and this set piece is another space place, but this is the medium uh, set piece that goes with my large set piece. And all I really have in here is like uh, deodorants, um, lotions, sunscreens, just stuff that I'm not going to use all the time. And some, t and I even have eyeliner and like a little bit of makeup stuff in there. So that's what I have in that pocket. And this one, this is my personal stuff of my time of the month stuff and just pills like for allergies and stuff like that. And since I'm not really using it, I don't need it right now. I just have it in there just in case because I like to be prepared and you just never know under the circumstances. And then also I have this um, section of... Uh, I don't even know the proper word for it right now. <laughs> I went blank. But this, I have it for my younger son because he has a lot of boogers right now. Um, and my kids had just got off of a really, it was like a cold. They've been really um, congested and measly and they're just getting off of it. But my baby is having a harder time so I have that just to take out the stuff from his nose and a lot of people tell me about the nose Rita but I haven't tried it yet but I think I might because I really don't like the whole sucking thing out because I'm scared to like stab his nose and I really don't want to do that so so yeah this is uh the jujube uh be right back in the out to sea print this print is actually not available anymore in store and most retailers don't really carry it anymore because this is an older print. I believe this was back in December that this print came out so it is no longer available. Um, you could try Mercari or Poshmark. This is really where I got mine, Mercari. And the reason I like Mercari and Poshmark, I know a lot of people don't like to buy off of there but... 
I tried it and I really like what I get out of it. I mean, this is a used bag and I really love it. I washed it, I took care of it, and it's in good condition. I love it. It's not like I wanted something super brand new, you know what I mean? I don't want to pay full price for something that I can get a good condition bag for, for a lot cheaper. And, uh, yeah, so this is not available anymore. But if you are interested in the Hello Kitty line of Be Right Backs like this, you can check their website, Jujubee, and see what they have available. Um, this is a really good bag, like I said. And, uh... If you do like this video and you would like me to do more uh, videos on packing or on different diaper bags, uh, I can do that as well. I also have a BFF uh, Jujubee backpack uh, diaper bag and I'll probably be uploading a video for that as well so you can see the differences in, in how to pack it and the differences in size and what you could use it for. So I'll probably be doing that as well. Um, yeah, so if you like this video, please subscribe. Um, this is my first video, so I'm really excited to see how this is going to go. And all feedback is appreciated, negative, positive. I really take my feedback to heart, so whatever you say, I will take it into consideration for my next videos. And I really do hope you enjoyed this video, and I will see you next time. Bye!